Hey everyone, welcome back to a new video. Today, we're going to create a very simple text animation in Blender. So, let's get started. First, add a text object and rotate it 90 degrees on the x-axis. You can type in any text, for now, I'll type, Blender. Next, navigate to the paragraph settings and align the text to the center. Then, extrude the text, something like this. Now, press Shift plus D to duplicate the text. Select the first text object and set it to None. Set the depth to around 0.01 to make it stand out. Now, the text is ready to animate, but before we start animating, let's give it some materials. Switch to Render View and, for the HDR and textures, you can use the Blender Kit add-in. Choose any HDR you like. If you want to adjust the lighting direction in the HDR, go to the Shading tab, select World Settings, and adjust the rotation on the Z-axis. It should look something like this. For the textures, I'll use a golden texture for the outer shape. If it's too bright, try changing the texture or the HDR. For example, I'll switch to an evening sky HDR, and now it looks much better. You can use any color or texture for the inner text as well. Next, to animate the text, we need to convert it to a mesh. Then press tab to enter edit mode, and press P to select, by loose parts. This will separate all the letters at once. Do the same with the outer text as well. Now we need to merge the individual parts of each letter manually by pressing Ctrl plus J. Once merged, select all the letters and set the origin to geometry. Now select all the letters, go to frame 80, and press I to set a keyframe for rotation. Next, go back to frame 1, select each letter, and set the rotation to 90 degrees. Press I again to keyframe the rotation for all letters. Now the text is animated. To make the scene more dynamic, add a camera and adjust its position. You can set a keyframe for the camera at frame 1, then move to the last frame and set another keyframe for a zoom effect. This adds a nice touch to the animation. Optionally, you can add a background color and some lights. If you want to experiment with reflections, feel free to play around with lighting setups for a more polished look. Finally, set the frame rate, resolution, and file format to video. Once everything is set, render the animation. And here's the result. You can experiment with different colors, textures, and effects to make it your own. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please don't forget to like and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one. Thanks for watching.